So one of the new features that the Samsung Galaxy S uh, class has taken on that is very similar to the Galaxy Note class is the ability to be able to show multiple windows. Let me show how multi-windowing works. First of all, you'll want to make sure that you have the multi-window function enabled. You see that right there? I have multi-function window enabled. So if that's selected, what you do is you press and hold the return or the back button here. And then this menu comes up. Right? This menu will tuck away in a second. If you don't press on it, it's going to hide. And if you want it to show again, you just tap it and it opens up. But here what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up a browser. And here I have a browser window that's open. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up another browser. Let me open up that browser again. I'm going to press and hold and drag it onto the screen. You notice that how it's highlighting the bottom half of the screen? Well, as soon as I let go, now I have two applications running side by side. Now, there are several applications that can do this. You'll notice here I have a full list of the ones that are compatible. So you could do email, you could do Facebook, you could look at pictures. Uh, you could also watch YouTube. You could take notes, work on a document. So any of these applications, and only the applications that appear on this bar, will give you the ability to have two windows open at the same time. And the point is, is that you can interact with each one of these separately. This happens to be the default browser that comes with the Samsung Galaxy S, and this is actually the Chrome browser that also supports that feature. So I could actually move around these pages, as you can see, independently, navigate from page to page, and have um, two, two applications running simultaneously.